It's funny you're here because I was just thinking about something that I really wanted to discuss and it's about the women's Rainbow Six Siege scene inside of the European circuit. I was wondering what more we could do to help elevate women in the competitive scene and it's not just women who are already good at the game, who already play in competitive teams, but I also want to elevate women at the grassroots level to learn what it's like to play competitively, to learn what it's like to communicate on a competitive level, the format, etc. I want women of all skill levels to get involved in competitive play in Rainbow Six Siege, especially in Europe. And for me to do that, I had to get involved with some pretty big hitters. Firstly, I've jumped on board with OPL to help run, administrate, and manage the league inside of Europe. And then we took one or two steps further, and we managed to bring in as our main partners and sponsors to this league, XMG, the leading laptop manufacturer inside of Germany, to be able to run this league at levels we've never been able to run women's league before. I also have a Thousand Dreams Fund in the background who will be providing grants to many women throughout the league to help elevate their content creation experience and beyond. Should they want that, there is a lot that we are doing here in this league and we're very, very ambitious. But to get XMG on board has been a massive help because the kind of lengths we can go to now that we have the leading laptop manufacturer involved is going to be awesome. It's really, really important to me that we grow this women's seed inside of Europe, not just short term, but also long term. And in thinking long term, a really good format that provides longevity essentially for women, both at the grassroots level and at the top tier level is really important. And so what I want as a result of that is a league that has a predominant main league, just like we see in tier one and EUL, but also a relegation system with upcoming teams can learn in essentially a challenger league style setting and then work their way up into a relegation system to make the main league. Again, I know this sounds ambitious, but this is really important for women to be able to progress beyond just women's leagues, but also into mixed teams. But we also want to be able to grow the scene just beyond the league. I mean, XMG has their initiative of XMG enables esports and with that kind of initiative behind us, we know there's so much that we can do to help hit our key core values of respect, fair play, equality, and of course, awesome competition. With XMG on board, there won't be anything cookie cutter. We'll bring the fun, we'll bring the banter, and we will help highlight women in the Rainbow Six Siege scene here in Europe to the top degree that we can. Make sure that you are watching.